Haley Smith. I'm interested in the beaching policy. Could you explain the offenses that would result in beaching? And does beaching automatically declare you, or does it mean you go public or make amends? I would love to hear an interview of a former Sea Org member who was beached. Okay, well, being beached is really, I, there's only one offense I can remember or recall that causes a person to be beached, which means being kicked off a boat and being left on the beach, you know, and they just, they just leave you there. And that has happened in the Sea Org's past. Um, the, the reason now, the reason why somebody would be beached at this point would be out too deep. They had sexual relations with somebody that they should not have. In other words, that they weren't married to, or they had unmarried, you know, they're not, they're not married at all, and they go and have sex with somebody as a Sea Org member, they're going to be in a lot of trouble. They're, gonna, they're supposed to get beached for that. It, it was the uh, situation for a very, very, very long time that that policy was basically ignored, and people were simply sent to the RPF, uh, which I've talked about. So, uh, I mean, that's what that's what I went to the RPF for. I didn't actually have sex with somebody else, but I, you know, had sexual type relations with somebody, uh, phone sex, and so um, that was enough to put it over the top, and off I went to the RPF. I should have been beached, see? And now that they are not really doing the RPF a whole lot anymore or assigning people to the RPF, they are beaching people who do that. Um, but context matters because if the person's very valuable or a resource that has had a lot of training, years of experience in the Sea Org, they're probably not going to beach the person. They're probably going to give them a, you know, slap around and a lot of ethics and maybe, you know, demote them from their post, but they're not going to kick them out of the Sea Org entirely unless the person actually wants to go. So that's, that's generally how that kind of thing works. Um, beaching is, um, I, I think there were a couple people back in the day who, like I'm talking about like back in the late 60s, early 70s, directly under Hubbard, who might have been beached for other reasons, um, but that's that doesn't really happen these days. So I don't know. That's uh, that's that's how that works.